Another local city has a proposed plan to cut down on the city's growing population of fierce and vicious dogs. Pawtucket has passed a similar ordinance banning new pit bulls and other dangerous dogs. Uh, now in Woonsocket, following in their footsteps, that's where Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Estefan went today looking for answers. Well, that's right. This is an issue we have reported on before. Banning certain breeds of dogs is a controversial issue. Now Woonsocket is the latest city trying to outlaw what some call dangerous dogs. Dangerous dogs, according to Woonsocket City Council President John Ward, are threatening public safety. A lot of the concern that's been expressed recently comes from the police department as they respond to domestic calls and for drug raids where they find dangerous dogs. Ward has proposed an ordinance, a carbon copy of the one in place in Pawtucket, that would ban any new pit bulls from coming into the city and would place extra restrictions on Rottweilers, including a requirement for owners to purchase liability insurance. Many opponents say the ban would not be fair, that it's not the breed of the dog that makes them dangerous, it's the owner. So we asked Ward about that. More often than not, it's a question of how the dogs are raised. My concern is how do we deal with the ones that are raised badly? Right now, the ordinance is in the infancy stage. We need to give people a chance to air it out and um, listen to our staff and find out what will work best. But the council's next step is to hold a series of public meetings to get both community response and ideas. Ward tells us those meetings should be complete by the end of December. No word on if passed when the ordinance could go into effect. In the newsroom, Nicole Estefan, Eyewitness News.